Hey guys, this is Ty Force Games, and I'm back to do a prediction video for the upcoming death battle, Virgil versus Sephiroth, or Sephiroth versus Virgil, whichever one, it doesn't really matter, but anyway, um, yeah, I have a, instead of wiki post, I've got <laughs> some Reddit posts, <laughs> because that's the, actually the closest thing I could find to, like, feats of strength and, you know, feats of, feats of weaknesses, I guess you could say, for the two of them, for, these are on, like, respect threads, so I don't know how, um, accurate these are, or how, um, um, or, you know, how canon these are, I suppose I should say, but, um, yeah, I'm just gonna, before I go over who I think is going to win, I'm just gonna go through what the posts say, and what, you know, for strength, durability, miscellaneous, their feats, and all that, so, yeah, um, let's just, uh, okay, first off, there's Sephiroth. Sephiroth for feats of strength. He cut a giant Mako cannon from far away and then rap rapidly cut it to pieces when he landed, redirected a large amount of falling debris with a single strike, blocked an attack that crushed the metal under him while he was smiling, <laughs> knocked Gen Genesis far back and crushed the ground underneath them with, with, with their clash, he kicked Cloud a decent distance and hard enough to break concrete, he threw Cloud a long distance back after blocking an attack that crushed the ground, held Cloud up with a sword, flung him high into the air, and slammed him back on the ground hard enough to dent it. And that's real, that's all I got. All I got here for strength, no doubt there's more to it, but um, yeah. Um, durability is he can tank a bunch of fireballs from Genesis and was completely unharmed. And it says Genesis' fire was capable of this, and I'm gonna... And it brings us to a GIF, or a GIF, whatever, however you want to pronounce it, but, okay, it's, um, it's kind of lagging, so. <laughs> what was it capable of? I, I see the fire, I'm, um, You'll have to excuse me. One thing, it's a GIF, and you know, what's the fire capable of? Don't lag, please. Stop lagging. <laughs> stop lagging. Hmm. That's quite the explosion. <laughs> Did he take again? Um, yeah, like a bunch, a bunch of them. All right, <laughs> completely unharmed. All right, he was stabbed in the back and out of the chest by Cloud, and able to fight, though much weaker, and cut through a metal wall afterwards. <laughs> All right, and miscellaneous other stuff is um, he fought both Genesis and NGL or whatever at the same time, dodged and parried every single attack from Cloud's Omni Strike. He can fall slowly, almost looks like he can fly, um, and uses bolt materia. And, and then there's another form called Safer Sephiroth, which he gained after falling to the life stream. Sephiroth's willpower kept him from being consumed. He gained strength, knowledge, and a new body while also learning how to control the Genova cells within himself to influence the outside world. His feats are created manifestations of himself that are capable of harming people, Killed a giant serpent off screen, said Sermon was stated to be over 30 feet tall. Controls people who also have Genova cells. Creates an, an illusion to trick someone and temporarily knocks out many more. Temporarily controls the heroes completely. They seem to overpower his influence. And here's the thing. Destroys the solar system with supernova. Now, it also has this said. This feat is quite notorious for not making a lot of sense, and there isn't too many great explanations for it. It could be an illusion, through, though a guidebook say, seems to say otherwise. If it does actually take place, then the best answer I have is the attack takes place in another dimension, and the party is hit with the, with the damage that bleeds through. Sadly, these are all fan theories in the end and require outside sources, so the supernova attack isn't really what it seems to be. It's... I have no idea, like like I said, the, these are fan theories, so, you know, just that. And that's all the feats of Saber Sephiroth and completing Sephiroth overall. Pretty powerful stuff, man. <laughs> like, even even now, I don't think this um truly 
grasp what Sephiroth is capable of, and I've only, like, seen him <laughs> in Final Fantasy VII Machina Bridge, so <laughs> you never know. And now for Virgil, the son of Sparta. He, and when it comes to strength, he cut off a giant living statue's head off in a, in a single strike, struck a man with the handle of his sword hard enough to send him flying back, and matched and defeated and defeated pre-awakening Dante. And says, pre-awakening Dante could do this. Please don't let it be another GIF. I think it is, but... Hmm. Um, what could pre-awakening Dante do? Please stop buffering. I need to know. I must know. What is this? <laughs> um, come on. Stop buffering. Please load faster. I must know. <laughs> oh, it's a picture. Okay. Hmm. It's basically a manga chapter, basically. Hmm. Or whatever. <laughs> comic, whatever. Hmm. Well, that's, I don't know, really, it's like, it's basically a manga, but I don't know how to judge that. It, it seems like a lot of power, like, it seems to destroy, you know, Devil May Cry, the, um, I think that's what it is, but, you know, um, yeah, quite, caused quite a lot of damage to that building, I must say. So, hmm. <laughs> Keep in mind, that was pre-awakening Dante, so, you know, whatever the heck that means. His speed, he cut multiple people in several pieces without any of them noticing him moving. Cut cut apart a demon at FTE speeds, I'm not sure, like, faster than something, I don't know. Um, um, I don't know, but anyway, ducks under gunfire and catch a bullet, caught a bullet with a... Caught a bullet with a sword, cutting it into six individual pieces. <laughs> Cut apart a demon in a in seemingly sing, single strike. Caught bull several bullets by spinning a sword at incredible speeds. Reacted to the sound of a rocket launcher while busy and cut the rocket. <laughs> His durability and endurance. He can break free of a demonic illusion that was said to turn people mad. Um, skill. He... He can precisely destroy a stuffed rabbit without harming the girl holding it in a single slash. With an air slash, I mean. Um, <laughs> wow. Defe defeated multiple demons easily. While jumping, he cut apart a demon's head. Def defeated several demons, moving around at incredible speeds, and sending, and sending his, sh his sheath through a demon. <laughs> his oh, then there's his regeneration. He sh which is similar to should be similar to Dante's as they are twins and were equal in power. It is limit to regen doesn't his regen doesn't slow down and he even once regenerated from being cut in half. <laughs> so yeah, um, that's regular and that's just regular <laughs> Dante I suppose. Well, that's not even going over his demonic powers, weapons, and weaknesses. So yeah. Now for demonic powers, there's this devil trigger, a state in which Dante can enter of his own free will, and he, he unleashes his de true demonic powers. What he changed into his demon form, his physical and magical stats are boosted to an unknown degree. There's no, there's been no solid indication how much stronger he becomes, but it's shown to adopt, adapt to weapons he wields. He summons, okay, summon swords. After obtaining Force Edge, Virgil unlocked the ability to create magic swords of pure demonic energy. He can create a multitude of them as well as manipulate them however he sees fit. He can create create a barrier around himself via the swords and surround his enemies with them or just several fire at once. And then there's Dark Slayer. Having embraced the dark the power of darkness, Virgil has obtained the power to teleport. Teleport near, above, or away enemies and it and enemies not required to teleport, whatever. Um, but yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and then there's his weapons, Yamato. Virgil's signature weapon. It was given to him by his father. It is a special weapon that can be used to open slash close portals to hell and is sharp enough to cut through anything. It says that in quotations, so. He seemingly creates a giant crater against the wall with a single slash. Kinsen slashes, keeping the cutting ability of a sword. With with a new move called with a move called Judgment Cut, he can unsheath his sword at blinding speed to cut through faraway enemies. That's also in quotations. 
It can use that attack multiple times in single success in in a single session. All right, and then there's Beowulf, a set of gauntlet and greaves that flow flow with sacred light, obtaining after killing a demon of the same name. They increase Virgil's speed and strength, and launch it launched a large demon into the air, and he cut it in half. <laughs> and then there's Force Edge, a powerful sword created and wielded by Dante's father. It is a powerful weapon, but has hidden, hidden locked away power that Virgil cannot unlock. Virgil intends to duel with, tends to duel with, duel wield it with Yamato, and is able to toss his sword, and he's able to toss this sword like a boomerang, which can stay midair, slicing enemies, <laughs> which is great. But then there's his weaknesses. Unlike Dante's cockiness, Virgil is overconfident, believing only in himself and taking on whoever, whoever, regardless of how weakened he is, viewing allies as mere tools that can be discarded once their use is no longer needed. So yeah. <laughs> and then there's, he should have the same weaknesses as Dante, such as if his heart is destroyed such impaled he would be inca incapacitated. He is not resistant to magical ice, lightning, piercing, mind control, and soul-based attacks. As he takes damage, he, his stats slowly weaken. It'll weaken to the point where he can be beaten and KO'd, and he was once KO'd by a far weaker enemy. So yeah, when it comes to weaknesses, it didn't show any like any real weaknesses for Sephiroth. I mean, I read somewhere that he's Sephiroth is very arrogant, kind of like much like Virgil, but. Other than that, I didn't see any real weakness other than, other than taking him out with brute force, which is pretty much how you how you win every game, every battle in that game. So, but yeah, um, it's gonna be a good fight. Like I said, it's gonna be a very very good fight. But hmm, as for who's going to win, it'll be a very very difficult one to choose. I'm probably gonna go with Sephiroth simply because I know him better, and you know Sephiroth's pretty cool. Um, and Virgil, well, I ha I've heard it both ways. Like, whenever I see like a like a fan debate or something, it's either Sephiroth or it's, or it's Virgil. Like, I read somewhere that it was Virgil. I read somewhere that it was Sephiroth. It's never, it's never been. There's never been a clear cut answer to me. So. I'm not really sure where to go. I'm going with Sephiroth simply because I like Sephiroth, and his feet seem to be seem to somewhat outmatch. Though, I've but I think Virgil might take this. Looking at how many weapons he has, what his weaknesses are, very weird. But it says he's resistant to magical lightning, which and Sephiroth wields like bolt materia, which I'm guessing is lightning materia. So that could definitely hurt him. Like so. So it's not just, you know, Sephiroth's 10-foot tall, 10-foot long sword, so, you know, that's great. And, so yeah. Not really, not really much to go on here. It's, but, like I said, I'm going, like, I'm rooting for Sephiroth, but I think Virgil might take it. I'm not quite sure. It really depends on, you know, if they're going to use Safer as Sephiroth or not, so... If it's safe, if safe for Sephiroth is used, it could go either way. But in any other circumstance, I think Virgil would win. But it's very weird. Like it's a, it's a weird situation. Like I'm personally rooting for Sephiroth. Like I said, like I've said this many times now. I'm re personally rooting for Sephiroth, but I think Virgil Virgil might take it. So that's all I gotta say. If Sephiroth wins, I'll have no complaints. If Virgil if Virgil wins, I'll say I called it. So. Yeah, <laughs> I suppose that's it. Till next time, guys. See ya.